Where have you been, St. Patrick? Where haven't I been? I'm after coming from the hill of Slain, where I lit a fire, and Larry's druids took me over to the hill of Tara, where I got these fine snakes. And is this the first time you're in Ireland? Unfortunately not. This is my second time. The first time, I was taken by Nile Niglonach, Nile of the Nine Hostages, and he took me prisoner, and I became a slave in the north of Ireland, on the mountains of Slemish, where a very cruel master called Milku. Ooh, Milku! And then I've been back there, but Milky wouldn't see me. He set himself on fire in his house. Oh, that's worse. But his children were nice to me when I was a slave, and they've come with me, with my followers, Gusok and the two Emirs. They're now my foster brother and foster sister. And tell me, you changed your name then to the family name, is that correct? Well, my name is Patricus in the Latin, but you can call me Patrick. <laughs> Thank you very much. And so what happened? What happened exactly, Patrick, that you came back here to help us here in Ireland? Well, I'm on my way to look for a crumb. You haven't seen him around here, have you? A crumb? What's a crumb? Crumb is the crumb con crew. Crumb at the bent back. He's the evil pagan god of Ireland. Ooh. I'm here to bring the word of God to Ireland to save it and bring Christianity and light into the darkness. Where did you get the stick, Patrick? I got this stick on the isle in the Bay of Naples, the Isle of Lepers. Jesus left it for me. It's called on Bacall Isa, the staff of Christ. And I use it to Christianize Ireland and for protection. Now you've come to Mullingar. Where are you going from here? Well, where exactly? Were you in Tara? I was in Tara and had to fight the Druids. I had to float up into the sky and they threw all their magic at me, the darkness. And I was able to overcome that. And Leary, your high king, is now baptized. So I'm on my way to find Crom. I hear he may be at Ishnok. There's a hill around here that the pagans worship on with the fire festival. And if I don't find him there, I'll pursue him into the west. He lives on a mountain in the west of Ireland. You're a very scary St. Patrick. I'm the real St. Patrick from the 5th century. If you're going to convert people, you have to be like this. Now tell us about the snakes. Did you bring some snakes with you? I have some snakes here from the hill of Tara. They were druids about an hour ago. And I have a few snakes in my bag for later on. Jelly snakes. Well. <laughs> the jelly snakes always go well. So, St. Patrick, are you going to stay around tonight and uh, join us tomorrow for the parade? I'm going to rest up here tonight because it'll be a very nice people bring me in on a boat here, same way that I came from Wales. So, I'm going to stay here and I'm going to come to your parade tomorrow. And we want to see everybody there. Can I have three cheers for St. Patrick? Hip, hip. Hip, hip. Hip, hip. St. Patrick, thank you very much for taking time to join us here in Mullingar. We're starting a brand new thing here. St. Patrick is St. Patrick's Eve. Now, if anyone would like to get a picture with St. Patrick for your Facebook page or for your Instagram or for your TikTok or your Snapchat, he's here and he'll be taking photographs. So mind yourself there now, St. Patrick, taken down. Oh, one, one photo.